hi everyone welcome back okay so i showed you how to make these preemie hats well i showed you how to make the three to four pounds in my last video and i'm going to show you how to make the five to six pounds in this one i could have done it in one video but i didn't want to confuse you so this one measures at four inches just a little bit over four from top to bottom the three to four pound measures uh, three and a half and this one is just under five and the other one measured four so this is five to six pounds they work up really quickly tiny tiny hats i think fit on my hand okay i will show you how to make this so i will show you the yarn again just in case you're only watching this one i've used um Warcraft dk yarn lightweight number three and uh, recommended hook is four, but I'm using five because I'm using a half double crochet stitch. And I think that because it's shorter, it gives it more of a chunky feel. And I like that rather than a double crochet. So let's begin. You can, for starting, you can now do the three chains, make a loop and then work in the loop. Or you can do a magic circle, which is what I'm doing. So. chain one and the first three rows are exactly the same as the other hat so we are doing eight half double crochets into the magic circle okay slip stitch the first half double crochet here Round one is done. Chain one, go into the very first stitch you've come out from and put two half double crochets in there. And each and every stitch, two half double crochets. And that will give you a total of 16. So, slip stitch into the first half double crochet, that's round two completed. Chain one. So, two half double crochets in the same stitch there, and one in the next. Two in the next, and one in the next. So you've got two half double crochets there, one here two into the next one, one into the next one. So that's your pattern, two, one, two, one. Do that all the way around. And you should end with one half double crochet in your last stitch because we started the two here. Don't make the mistake and go in here thinking if you look from the top, this little one here that's on the slant, that's your first half double crochet. Okay, that's round three. So this round three was exactly the same as the three to four pounds. Now we will do an, another extension to the crown. So the pattern is two half double crochets in the first stitch, one in the next, one in the next. Back to two in the next, and one in the next, and one in the next. So the pattern here is two half double crochets in one, and then one in each of the next two. So it's two, one, one.
You can add any trimming or border to the end of this hat. You can do a shell border if you want to make them for little girls. If you want to keep them unisex so they can work both for boys and girls. And this is the very simple plain hat, which is great. my last one now it's just two in here one in here and one in here and slip stitch to the first half double crochet here so that is all the extensions uh sorry extending the circle so far we have one more round and this one is seven half double crochets one in each stitch and then two seven and then two so going to the very first one here, place one, half double crochet, it's two, three, four, five, six, and seven, and then two into the next one. Okay, seven again, so one, two, three, four. and seven and then two into the next do that all the way around And you should finish with two. Okay. That's the crown for the five to six pounds. And what we need to do in the other hat, we did five rows of half double crochet by chaining one on each round working half double crochets all the way around you should have 36 stitches okay so go ahead and do i'll start off the first one for you so chain one always go into the same stitch that you've come out from place your first half double crochet and you're doing just half double crochets all the way around we did five rows for the other hat but we're doing six now from this point onwards so this is Okay, so I've just started my first one. Go ahead and do six rows. Six rows in total and I'll meet you back here. Okay, so we've completed those rounds. We should have 11 rounds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 11. Just completed the six rows of half double crochet and then your last round will be just a simple uh, single crochet. As you know, I like things simple. It gives it a nice little single crochet edging here, just finishes off the work. But you can do any edgings that you want. If you're making for a girl, you can go ahead and add any borders or flowers. This is just to show you a basic simple hat that you can make. So single crochets all the way around and should be a total of 36. And then we're done. These are really cute and simple. Like I said, great to whip up if there's an unexpected arrival. And um, not only that, great for charity work, great for hospital donations. And then, like I said, as I made the booties, I thought we need to have a hat to match them. My yarn is not leaving me alone today. <laughs> okay, so we're nearly there. And all you need to do then is just slip stitch into the last single crochet here. 
chain one and then cut your yarn and then tie in your ends this one's a magic circle here on the inside i won't show you how to tie ends just thread your needle and in and out a couple of times the same with this side and here we are see this a yellow one earlier on there's a green one and there's a baby one even more teeny tiny really cute so hope you've liked this tutorial thank you for all your support and thank you for liking and sharing and again as i always say please do share to someone who you think would love to make these or actually do donate a lot to charity this will be the ideal quick hat hat for them Thank you for watching and I have a few ideas. I'll see you on the next one.